Boxes. What the hell? I ain't going back in there. No way. It's pretty obvious that we're moving, Wolverine. All of Jason's stuff is packed up and probably already at his house. This is unreal. I can't believe this is happening. It's like the end of an era, Captain. The end of an era. I want to be in the same box as Gene. Hook like David is. Speaking of DVDs, I watched The Notebook yesterday and cried the whole time. Homo. The movie reminded me of Gene. Yay, the box. Now you all know how I feel. Why would Jason pack us up and then leave? Wolverine, calm down. He's just moving things into his car. He'll probably bring us in there soon. This is so depressing. I like fun car vibes. Car is motorized vehicle. I just wanted to say we have a long journey ahead of us. Oh yeah, that's right. I've been in one before. So we go to the place. We're leaving the apartment and going to Jason's house. Well, I hope he's got food there. Wolverine, what? How many times do I have to tell you? Hey, get off my boss, fool! He, yay, we're going to Jason's house now, yay! That's because you act like a kid all the time. Stop patronizing me. Oh. I don't want any of you to cross that line. That's what she said. I don't want the lollipop. You're looking for a fight, Captain. You just drown out. All I'm saying is that you try reading every once in a while. It's quite relaxed. And all I'm saying is that I want to be left alone when I'm dumping a big one on the can. Wow, check out all these empty Mighty Mug boxes, pun pun. Jason dropped them off this morning, along with all of his other stuff. He must be moving back here today. Oh snap, really? I heard him talking to his mother. He was going to make two trips. One in the morning, and one in the afternoon. Wow, he should be home any time then. Personally, I wouldn't mind a few new buddies to chill out with. I mean, you're fun and all, Pun Pun, and I got your back, but let's face it, you're pretty much a stiff most of the time. You're just lucky that I don't know something about it. <laughs>